that unmistakable sound of vinyl. For the older ones who remember, they will be happy to know that long-playing records are making a comeback as South African artists are producing vinyl records again and LP stores are back in business. Record Mad really started off as a storage space with um, the idea that I would have time to list records online and um, you know people come in and browse if they felt like it. You know, I have um, fathers and sons and mothers and daughters and you know from 13 to 75 come in and buy records and they've all got their own thing. Quite a lot of the older generation who are, you know stopped listening to music in 1979 you know, are, are getting into music again. For younger generations who are used to listening to CDs and digital downloads, this is a great opportunity to get to know this old household item that mum and dad grew up with and connect with music and listen to it the old fashioned way. Or as many vinyl lovers would say, the only way. Most importantly, it is the sound of vinyl, which is so superior to CD, and to the digital age. Not that I'm dissing it because it isn't part of modern world living, um, but at the end of the day, there's nothing nicer, nothing warmer than playing vinyl, you know, and also the experience, you know, you've got to buy the record, you've got to take it out of the cover, you've got to put it on, you've got to clean it, you've got to look after it. You know, it's a sort of ritual thing that um, is an enjoyable experience. <laughs> Many youngsters are also beginning a love affair with vinyl and enjoying the experience. So, so. Growing up, I never experienced vinyl in the way that uh, the older generations have. I feel like almost immersed in the music, which is something I didn't really experience with my sort of music, which was from CDs to MP3s and iPods. And that's what I've grown up with. But the reintroduction of vinyl in South Africa does have challenges, as record producer and vinyl enthusiast Benji Moody told me. The market here really is confined to about 90% of the market is second-hand or pre-owned, as some people like to call it. Um, and 10% is, the new, is uh, on the new vinyls, and th those are, are very, very expensive. That is my favorite. I play this at least once a week. The rebirth of vinyl is making a comeback, and in South Africa, buyers are ranging from the nostalgic to the curious, contributing to the new era of vinyl. Julie Shara, CCTV, Johannesburg.